Just as the RM90 minute scandal cools off, PAS found themselves mired in another controversy when the party's chief son-in-law Zaharuddin Muhammad lashed out against a group within the party, whom he dubbed as the Dark Cartel. Earlier this month, Zaharuddin exposed five individuals whom he alleged had received funds from AMNO, or those linked to the Malay party. In a Facebook post on 12 May 2019, Zaharuddin, whose name has been linked to the party's audio recording scandal involving member Nick Abdul Nick Aziz, listed the five individuals as Dr. Husam Sakan, Mr. NT, Mr. KT, Mr. KH, and the fifth as Samoa Dahtahu on his official page. However, Zaharuddin insisted the biggest culprit in the cartel to be Dr. Husam II, whom he alleged to sneakily do many things without the knowledge of Mr. Two right up to Mr. Five. Consequently, his revelation on Facebook had caused a stir within the party, with Zaharuddin's critics reportedly urging Hadi Awang to ask him to drop his allegation off his Facebook. Following the disclosure, past Secretary General Datuk Takyudin Hassan also took the matter into his own hands. He issued a gag order on all its members, prohibiting them from discussing about party matters openly, including on social media platforms. To this, Zaharuddin countered by saying that he will not stay silent and will continue to speak until action is taken, even if it is done internally. Additionally, the Sungai Buloh Pass chief also said that Abdul Hadi Awang had previously given him the green light to reveal the existence of the group within the party. Interestingly, this was denied by Hadi himself. Responding to Zaharuddin, Hadi said the claim was untrue and that he did not give his blessings on the Datuk Karta revelation to his son-in-law. In a report by the Malaysian Insight, Hadi also said that the Datuk Cartel issue was an old issue being played up again. As expected, speculations on Zaharuddin's five mysterious individuals were swiftly made by netizens on social media. For example, Mr. NT is the acronym for Nasruddin Tawawi, while Mr. KH stands for Kahlil Abdul Hadi. Meanwhile, Samoa Dahtahu is Nick Abdul Nick Aziz because of his leaked audio related to the RM90 million scandal. In response, Zaharuddin denied that Terengganu Menteri Besar Ahmad Samsuri and past youth chief Muhammad Khalil Abdul Hadi, who is the eldest son of Abdul Hadi Awang, are part of the Dedak Cartel. Nevertheless, Zaharuddin did not deny the other three being a part of the group. Does this mean that the other three speculated members of the Dedak Cartel are true? Who the viewers think are the five mysterious individuals?